a key role of patent law is to balance the rights of current innovators with the rights of future innovators. So imagine, for example, that you are a drug developer and it takes lots and lots of research dollars in research and development and in doing clinical trials to figure out if that drug is effective. But copying that drug is relatively inexpensive. Absent patent protection, which allows you to prevent others from copying your drug, you just won't be incentivized to invest all of that money in innovation in the first place. Now, patent law can also hinder the work of future innovators by creating what is called a patent thicket. And to understand patent thickets, let's look, for example, at an iPhone. So the iPhone has attached to it hundreds of different patents. So if you want to make an innovation to improve iPhone technology, in order to market your innovation, you will need to get licenses from all those patents that belong to innovators who came before you. Future innovations may be disincentivized from innovating in the first place because of costly patent thickets. This is why STEM professionals would really benefit from a working knowledge of intellectual property. Learn this and more in the Master of Science in Law at Northwestern Pritzker School of Law.